Hello friends and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be unboxing this Artful subscription box for the months of March to May. If you don't know, Artful is a quarterly subscription box that sends art supplies with a different theme every three months. This month is the colouring box. Each box costs around £39.95. Let's have a look at this little box and see what's inside. So here we can see that Artful provide lots of different content as well as upgrade boxes. I had really good impressions when opening this box as this design looks very sleek which encapsulates the pencils with a nice Artful embossed logo. Taking an initial look at the pencils, it looks like there is a nice variety of 36 coloured pencils. My first impressions when I saw this case was that the pencils look very sleek as the pencils go from higher to lower at the front so you can see all of your pencils. I really did think this was a great looking case, but later on I find that it's a little bit impractical but I will discuss that later on in the video. It's nice to see that in this month's quarter there is a lovely print that's provided. This print is by Suri Bisonin. I should also probably mention that the beautiful artwork all over this box was by Jonathan Empson. Next up we have the Artful A4 drawing pad which has 40 sheets of A4, 160 weight, acid free, premium heavyweight textured paper. Although it says it's textured, I found it really to be nice and smooth and of a decent quality in first impressions. Next up was this swatch card. I thought it was really cool that Artful included a swatch card in this quarter's box. There was also some pencils in this box, so a 6B pencil as well as a HB pencil. I think it was nice that they provided these in this box as the 6B you'd use for darker heavier lines as it's a softer pencil whereas HB just for general sketching. There's also a really cool ruler. I know it's just a ruler but this is one of my favourite finds in the box as it's quite rare to find a 20cm ruler as you often have 12cm or 30cm but 20 seems just right to fit in a pencil case. Then we have some artful blank greeting cards and envelopes. I thought this was really nice in the last artful box that I reviewed as you can make your own little cards to send to people with the art supplies you have. As I was unboxing, I didn't realize there's also a 6H pencil, which is also really handy. This is a harder lead pencil so it's most suited to when you're doing light sketching. There is also a sharpener included and also a rubber, which I will test out later on in the video. Artful boxes have always appealed to me as they include everything you need to get started with a different art medium. And finally, we have the Artful magazine. As always, this magazine is really informative detailing about different art supplies as well as different techniques, artists to inspire you, different articles as well as tutorials. So here I'm just flicking through the magazine to give you a flavour of what this quarter's magazine includes. I'm really looking forward to get stuck into it a lot later as there really is plenty to read and do. Next up, I'm deep diving into the art supplies and testing them all out. So as you can see here, I laid out the pencils in a sort of approximate rainbow order and then I swatched each colour with the swatch card that was provided by Artful. The way I decided to swatch these colours was to show a gradient, so from lots of colour fading into lighter shading. As these coloured pencils are oil based pencils, I heard that the best way to get a gradient with these pencils is by layering. Here are the final results of my swatching. As you can see, there's really good colour payoff and overall I was really happy with how vibrant the colours looked 
and how well they blended. Although I love the pencils themselves, the case that they came in just was a little bit impractical for me. I tried to order my pencils in a way that made sense, but it was really challenging as all the pencils need to be in the pencil case in order to order them, otherwise they'll like just flop around. <laughs> also, it's maybe easy to grab pencils that are on the outside, but if there's some pencils jammed right in the inside, you have to pick them up from the lead which is just slightly a little bit impractical for me. I also imagine in the future you won't use your pencils at the same rate, so some will be shorter than others and some longer, so that might make this case a bit challenging to use in the future, so that's worth bearing in mind. Next up I decided to do another blend test, so blending the cardinal colour as well as orange pop and sand Overall I found the blending process to be quite pleasant and I think it achieved a really good blend. Next up I tested the graphite pencils in this box. I thought that these three were a really good selection of hard and soft pencils. And then I tested out the rubber. I wasn't a massive fan of the rubber just because it took a few raises to get what I wanted out of it. Next up, I thought it would be good to compare the Artful Black Pencil with a Like for Like Pencil, which is the Faber-Castell Polychromos Black Pencil. This pencil is also oil-based, so I thought it would give a good comparison. I don't have many professional coloured pencils, but I do have this one as I use it for my graphite drawings, so black is a really important coloured pencil for me to use and have. You'll soon see me swatch the Artful Coal Black colour. I have to say that I was very impressed as the colour is a lot richer than my Polychromos version, so it's definitely something I'd consider switching to when I do my graphite drawings. Overall, I was really happy with the art supplies in this box. I hope this review is useful to you and if it was let me know. If you haven't already be sure to subscribe as next week I will be putting these art supplies to the test whilst drawing some adorable animal characters from one of my favourite games of all time. Also if you enjoyed this review be sure to check out my previous review of the Artful Watercolour Box.